Hello, good morning everyone. Welcome to my channel, Cooking with Earl. Subo nga aga, mapakita naman ako gilas paano magluto sa budbud uh, suman bisaya or ilonggo. In my way, ha. Yung down sa saging, patubog ko lang anay sa tubig. Para hapos, hapos lang mag ang sagi na palapad mo pa is sirabon sa, ano, sa kalayo it's the easiest way I think oh, tumoy hmm. kung nagaluto kada isang tag, isang kabanada na wala, isang kasako ng mga suman hmm. kuhaan na lang itong daon sa saging, baruru na roll them then dip in enough water boiling water Okay. I think makabulig ini sa inyo kung paano. Kamo magpadali sang inyo nga mga ubra. Okay. Luto. Luto ang luto pero dapat may technique. Okay. Six cups. Need uh, we need uh, six cups. Because I'm making uh, at least 70. Uh, 40 pairs of budbud today. So, uh, I must share 6 cups of uh, glutinous rice. So, this is soaked already in uh, water. <coughs> I washed 3 times and then soaked in water for at least 2 hours. 1 hour to 2 hours. Anyway, luto on pa man And then, steam mo pa ni. And then, I have here the glut, the um, gata. Oh, extracted from these two coconuts freshly grated coconut then bring this to boil okay I heated already the pan And then add the malag kit. Okay, add a sugar. For every two cups, let's add one sugar or less. Hindi ko anay pag-obosan, guys. Basi tamis. Hindi ko gusto matamis. I don't want to be sweet. Bili lang yun. For every two cups of glutinous rice, let's add one half teaspoon of salt. So now I'm adding one tablespoon because I used two cups. Okay. Here. Continue mixing. Or, or boil it. As in uh, cooking rice. Just like cooking rice. A 
once you keep it on boiling, uh, continue stirring so to avoid scorching. Uh, wag dumikit sa ilalim ng or sa pinaglulutuan. And then, I will add one tablespoon of dikdik na ginger, yung pangpasarap. So, ginger, guys. You may add vanilla too if you want, but this is optional because ginger is already good. Flavor, okay? One scoop. One scoop is equivalent to one teaspoon. So let's continue boiling till the liquid absorbs and the rice. So you can mold it into your banana wilt. Your wilted banana like. I will taste if the flavor is okay or the sweetness. Mm, it's okay. So my three cups of sugar, I less one half cup of the sugar. Not so sweet, but just enough. We don't need to, we don't tend to uh, to uh, our client will get sick of diabetes too. Uh, uh, eating too much of this glutinous rice, rice, is uh, so much of the sugar in here. So we will, uh, at least if we can uh, make it less sugar. Decrease the amount of sugar in our diet or in our food. So many recipes I've tested already, but uh, to, as much as possible, I am. Um, Decreasing the amount of sugar in their recipes. So, continue stirring more. At least 10 minutes more. Till there is no more water in here.
Okay. It's almost. It's almost done. I think it's this enough because as it gets cooler some of the moisture here will uh, still absorb uh, of course we uh, we need to cool this for uh, about 20 minutes more so we can uh, put it in the banana leaves So I'll put off the fire now. Then transfer in another container for cooling. Ow. So you see guys. As it cools, the moisture is gone. It absorbs in already in in the rice. Okay. Now this is ready for wrapping in the banana leaves. As much as possible, let's uh, prepare our banana welted, you know, clean, and free from uh, other impurities. Okay, by Okay, punasan natin guys. Although gin lubong ko na ni sa tubig, nga nagabukal, so it still made punas. You see, dipping in uh, boiling water is uh, effective also in disinfecting you no know, leaves of bananas okay and then let's cut about isakadangaw uh, uh, guys isakadangaw okay so this this way this way or this this wide see oh. so let's make about 70 or 100 so my extra for us my client needs uh, 35 pairs today and then the extras okay, my, we want it also we want to eat also our family wants also but board so I made some extra also for our own okay this is the technique to feed your family see you cook for your clients at the same time you also cook for your family so 
So, isa na lang. Diba? Tipid. Okay. Let's start putting it in the leaves. Just watch. One teaspoon only. Okay, round. One tablespoon. Yeah. Para na ng suhit, busog, lusog. See? Then roll. Close the end. Then the other end. So just like, and then just make, lay it flat until you come, you, you will have another one. And then make it pair. And then tie. I have provided here same banana, banana leaf to tie it. Okay, this is how it looks. So nice. Parang natakam-takam na. Mas masarap talaga. Proseso pa lang eh. Mag masarap na. Masarap na gawin kasi grabe. You know what guys? I sell it at 5 pesos each. This one. So, for every pair, this is 10 pesos. Okay? So, 10 pesos. Saan ka pa? Diba? Negosyo tips. Okay. I have already another one. Be sure, be sure you uh, tight them nice so when it gets boiling in the water, it will uh, not spread. You know what? My partner in cooking is my husband and my son. 
and my good son. So whenever, whenever I uh, need bananas, because we have plenty of bananas in our backyard, uh, so just request them, and then I will give you. So I have to finish this in one hour. One hour um, until cook. It's steamed already. So I have to do it quickly. So, malapit na, matapos. Simote natin guys. Sayang naman ang butil ng bigas. Mahal ang bigas. Okay.